Audrey McDonald is back on Broadway. The five-time Tony winner is playing Billie Holiday in Lady Day at Emerson's Bar and Grill, and we're here on opening night to catch all the excitement. What do you think they're serving up today at Emerson's Bar and Grill? Um, I think they're serving up fierceness and fabulousness. Um, I think some uh, barbecue ribs and uh, some chicken wings and <laughs> I heard it was like all you can eat. I think this is going to be a lot of things and all of them delicious. Otter McDonald and Billie Holiday all wrapped up into one. That's like, that's like chocolate with like a creamy nougat center. That's like too much goodness. One of the great things about um, watching Audra is, is watching her stretch and do so many different kinds of roles and play so many different kinds of women. She's always honest on stage and genuine and organic and I cannot wait to see this. Well, I've never seen Audra actually perform live. You know, I've, I've, I've been a fan of her work through, you know, all the different mediums, but to actually see it happen there, it's going to be quite an experience, no doubt. Audra is the queen of Broadway. Anything that she does is amazing. It's like watching a master class every time you watch her on stage. She's the best, and you, it's always an amazing privilege to just watch her inhabit a character. And uh, the fact that I know so little about what I'm about to see is really exciting. Congratulations on your opening night. How do you feel? I'm okay, you know, it's it's an exhausting role and it sort of uh, drains me, so I'm just relieved that we're done for the night. <laughs> it's been an incredible journey to see a brilliant talent that Audra uh, McDonald is go into the embodiment of another brilliant musical talent. Seeing you smoke and drink and swear like this must be kind of fun. Well, you know, I mean, it's if you listen to old tapes of Billie Holiday, it's absolutely how she talked. I mean, even in a lot of the old recordings that you hear of her in rehearsal, you hear her asking for a match. At one point, she says, "Where's the gin?" I mean, and and um, and she cussed like a sailor from the moment you know she could start to talk. She always spoke like that, and and so um, it's been fun for me. It's an excuse excuse to talk like that, I guess. Part of Audra's bravery, I think, is going out there and living the moment, moment to moment. That's an extremely frightening thing to do. When I think of Audrey McDonald, I think of a very legit voice. Uh -huh. And Billie Holiday is so different. Tell me about doing that with your voice. It took a year and a half of trying to figure out how to sound like her. And, um, and uh, but now that I've figured it out, every night, you know, before I go on, I'm listening to tapes of her talking and, and tapes of her singing and the songs that I'm supposed to sing in the show. And uh, I warm up like I think Billy would warm up, and uh, I, it sounds hideous. I mean, if you were outside of my dressing room, you'd think, "Who's shooting a cat in there?" You know, it sounds pretty awful. But um, it's just to get it in the right to get it in the right place. Obviously, you've done a lot of concerts in your career, but in this show, you get to really interact with the audience. What is yes. that like for you? Um, I think Lonnie Price put it best. He says it's like having um, a, a new understudy on every single night because you know we never know what the audience is going to be like or how they're going to act. What do they say, 10% inspiration, 90% perspiration? And uh, every great person I've ever worked with has worked hard, and Audra is the epitome of a hard worker. She's never satisfied. She's uninterested in praise. It's all about how do we make it better. We're just trying to tell her story, you know? She, you know, whether the specifics, you know, the exact dates and details, you're absolutely accurate. No one truly knows because Billy kind of, you know, changed her story every time she told it. But these are, a lot of the words in Lainey's play are words that came directly from Billy's mouth. So that's all we've got to go on, so that's what we're using. To find an actress who can sing that well, that she has both those skills in such enormous quantity. Um, you know, we talk about it, she's not just a great actress or a great singer, she's a great American artist. And to have a great American artist play another great American artist is a, is a thrill.